Friday night in East Hampton. We're going out tonight. We've got a fun weekend ahead. I picked Delaney up from the train station this morning. Caitlin's on the train on her way now. And uh, Delaney's right in here working. She's such a working gal. Um, we've all just been at the pool all day hanging out and now it's time to get ready for the night of nights. <laughs> I debated vlog, oh right. I debated vlogging cause it's like a weekend, but I just, weekends are so fun and maybe we'll get a little unhinged Danny content. We don't really know what's gonna happen, but nothing is better than being outside at the pool all day and then you shower and you feel sun kissed. I know, like that. We're doing a pregame here, which nothing hits more than a house pregame. Like, I'm so excited. I ordered, guys, I ordered mom waters to the house because they don't sell mom waters in New York. So I had them shipped to the house. So I've got my mom waters and then um, Katie and Jack are coming. It's Katie and Jack's like one year anniversary, I think around this time. And they started, like he asked her to be his girlfriend in the Hamptons. So they're doing like a little weekend getaway and they're joining us tonight too, which is just so fun because obviously Katie and I were in the Hamptons together the last two summers. Um, so it's gonna be a great group. And we got a table at Common Ground. And you guys know I love Common Ground in the city. And apparently Common Ground in East Hampton is popping off this year. Like we ran into Tinks this morning and she was like, wait, I'm going there tonight too. So I'm like, all right, this must be the place. I feel good about it. Everyone, no one knows what we're wearing. We're all like, what are you wearing? What are you wearing? And it's all, it's like fun to be a girl. They'll be like, so what are you wearing? Delaney's outfit that I hope she's wearing tonight is so chef's kiss, so cute. And we got Feeny Pizza, which is like a popular pizza spot. And Amagansett, the boys went and picked it up. Ryan brought me flowers today, it was so cute. And that's that, so let's go check on everyone else. Hello, she's a working woman today. <laughs> let's see what's going on down here. The boys are like, we don't need to get ready until 30 minutes before. <laughs> hey guys. I see some rosé is out, looks good. We tried to clean a little bit. Guys, Ryan got me flowers, I think. Did you? Yes. Okay. I thought so, thank you. Sunflowers, so cute. Ooh, this is so, I love the limes. Kelly brought a candle, of course, to set the vibes. We've got so much pizza from Feeny. I can't wait to try it later. That's like a good base before going out. Why do we love I love, hello, oh, I just wanted, I'm starting my weekend vlog. Hey. Oh yeah, you gotta teach me the twerking hey. routine. Hey. Hey. Hey, hey. Kelly would have a candle going in here. It's lovely, whatever that is. My favorite is Cafe Society. Cafe Society, noted. I love Kelly because she has all of her like things out and about. Oh Cherry wanted to, are we doing legs on the wall? Yeah, it's on the wall. This is Cherry, if you guys didn't already know this, and she loves to be a part of the girls' room. Oh, oh I love being a woman. <laughs> Welcome to my closet. Yes, I 100% unpacked everything. Like, honestly, packing next week is gonna suck. Well, actually, we're not leaving for a while still, so it's it's far. I need to figure out what to wear tonight. The infamous, what are you wearing? What are you wearing? Oh, I don't know, I'm thinking this, like, you know. But I really am thinking this, because we're going to Common Ground, it's gonna be at night. I feel like drinks will get spilled, so I wanna wear something like darker, maybe, question mark. So I got this set from Lioness. It's like kind of sheer. So I don't know, I have to try this on right now and see what undergarments I need. I thought like a black bikini, but I also don't want it to look too much like a cover up. But this is the top and then it's a long black skirt with roses on it. So this is the front runner. And then I also have these two like colorful fun dresses. One of them I'll probably end up wearing to Surf Lodge, but that's not till next weekend. So I need to wear one tonight or like one this weekend. Like we have stuff tomorrow too. So like that's something. So this is like a strapless colorful dress with a necktie. It's honestly so cute, but I don't know if it's the vibe for tonight. I feel like that's more daytime. This also could be considered more daytime and it's like a nicer dress. It's like colorful chevron, a little cutout moment, but I also feel like this needs to be daytime. I think this will be next weekend too. <laughs> okay, well I gotta wear those next weekend. Then I also have this, which is like from, it's from Meshki. It's a beautiful kind of knit dress with really pretty flowers on it. So it could be a possibility for tonight. And then I also have this set from Camila Calejo, but I just fear there's just gonna be things spilled on it fast. I'm not feeling that tonight. Just because when you're in a club and it's dark and people are just bumping into you. I went once last year to this place and there's just people on people on people. So I don't know why I'm so concerned about that, but I am. <laughs> so let's try it all on and figure it out. Okay guys, so here's this outfit. I have a black bikini bottom on. Then I'll just wear like nippies up top. I don't know. It's like dark and it's good for like a night out, I guess. 
I also have a short torso, so like I'd love for you to see some skin. What do you think about this? I like it. You like it? Turn up like I want to see my butt. You want to see my butt? I'd have to wear some sort of heel just because I'm short with like jewelry. I don't hate it. I'm gonna try on the other option. Here's option two, but also could be worn for a more beachy occasion because this is like night out, but this is so cute. It's from Meshki. I love her. I don't know. And then I have this one, which again, I have a shorter torso, so you don't see as much skin as I'd like. It's a dress, but it's like a bodysuit with a skirt. It's very fun. Delaney says it's dancer emoji. Delaney, which one's your favorite? Okay, so the second one is my favorite. The second oh, is your okay. favorite. The first one is like more than I think. But the first is more, the, the black is. Yeah, the second, because it'll go with me. Then I'll be more than I. I could wear the black one, I could wear the black one tomorrow. Okay. Maybe. Yes, yeah, then I'll wear white tomorrow. And then you'll wear white, and we'll be back white. So you, not this, not to. I like it, but it's not my But favorite. it's not your favorite. Okay. Um, all right. Okay, now I don't know because two of the other girls said they like this and I feel really good in this. So I'm struggling. It's been decided. I am wearing this dress. I love it. It's from Revolve. It's a dress, but it kind of like, honestly, some people might hate it, but I love it. I feel good in it. I made it a little bit more beachy. I added this necklace from J. Crew, actually. These Dolce Vita heels, because I can wear them all night and I plan to dance. So yeah. I put my Luxie hair extensions in. I've been wearing them a lot here. I just feel like it's very mermaid, very fun. They're just such easy clip-ins to put in. And Caitlin's about to be here. Katie and Jack are about to be here and the party's gonna start. You excited? I'm excited. Woo! Woo! Look at Delaney's outfit. Thanks, Harry. You look majestic. Thanks, darling. I love it. Should I connect to... Wait, maybe Ryan, would you connect to the speaker? Oh, yeah. Because I feel like I might make TikToks. I love having long hair. It's so fun. Okay, we're going to open a drink. This is my first drink. Or, no, this is not my first drink in the Hamptons. My first mom water in the Hamptons this summer. Because I also ordered them last summer to the house. Cheers. That tastes good. You look so cute with the mixed match shoes. What? I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, this is so. I really do love this. Okay, but like with jewelry and stuff, yes. I would do this shoe, I think. But yeah, the white. Obviously casual. I like can. As long as you can do like that, your hair looks so good. Wow. Or I have like. Um, <laughs> I love this. But is it boring so for cute. what we're doing? No, oh my god. Out, but we're squeezing no, it you're really, you look so cute. I it's like so hard to decide. Show a little. <laughs> She's so like, yay! Yay! you all summer. Thank you. You're welcome. Look who has arrived. Oh, Miss Kate. Wait, show your earrings. I love oh. them. Uh, they not are. Cool. I didn't realize how big they were, and I love them even more. They're big, but they're not heavy. That's important. Cheers to you being Cheers. here. I love it. All right, prayers, y'all. We're back together. Prayers. Prayers. Yes. Get up. Undress. This reminds me of Vegas. Red light, green light. Get up. Yeah, same thing. Undress. I'm so excited for tonight. What are we doing? One, two, three, four. Not even more. And me, Caitlin, and Jelani are going to get some coffee. I've been wanting to try Tudo Cafe 
for some coffee. Got my boxer pants on again. And we're also getting dog dip materials for Ryan to make for everybody. Dog dip time. Dog dip. Got our professional stir over here. They went to this place called Amber Waves. And this is Landon's burrito. Yeah. <laughs> it looks good. Wait, Landon, show your hat. So this is Landon's brand. <laughs> kind of handsome. I love this hat. Let me show the other side. Kind of handsome. At rest. I'm modeling you. Right now. <laughs> You're doing. And he has the other one. Is this still for on like available or no? It is, yeah. This is like the classic. The way this one fits your head is so nice. Mm -hmm. I don't know how to explain it. Like not just your head, but like everyone's head. Sorry, Ryan. Yeah. Like every, I don't know. I like it. Like the way this I know. It's like, like, it's like, like, it's like, 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 let me clarify. It's hugging it all. I know. It's hugging Ryan's head. I'm selling Ryan's head right now. Do you like some sandies? Oh my gosh! Thank you. Delaney made us some little sandwiches in her little Hawaiian outfit with some Hawaiian. And rolls, I love it, so cute. We are headed to the pool. I've got my full look on right now for no reason. I don't look cute at all, I just wanted to feel something. So I put on my little Luisa Balu set. Cherry is thrilled to be going outside. Super casual, Kelly just left and she's going to do Alex Earl's makeup. <laughs> I was like, oh bye, casual. So I'm sure that's gonna go great. And there's the... The sun is out. It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood. Yay! Guys, Cherry just like sat in my lap. It's so cute. Hi, cutie angel pie. I'm listening to some country music. Thank God for these Elements Sparkling Waters. This is not, this vlog is not sponsored, but I do just love these so much. This is my favorite flavor, citrus salt. And I love that they came out with sparkling because whenever I'm hungover, I need something sparkling. And then it has the Element Electrolyte Powder and it's amazing. I do have like a little like, code situation if you go to drinkelement.com slash Danielle Carolyn uh, you get a free sample pack with any purchase so you could like buy the sparkling cans and then you get like a whole free pack of all the different flavors of the powders so just thought I'd let you guys know everyone's inside rotting and then we were we were too we were totally rotting and then we were like I don't want to rot anymore we've officially got our people starting to come outside bringing the dog dip out here is smart this is how you lure them out mmm Mmm! Oh wow. The boys are doing a diving contest for us and it's been very enjoyable. Or jumping in general. The body by technique. Smallest splash. Woo! That was a small splash, that was good. How was that? That was good. That was good. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> it kind of feels nice. I don't think Ryan's capable of a small splash. No, he's not. <laughs> Let's go, Jay! Whoa, whoa! A front flip dive. Was that on purpose? Was it good? It kind of. What? Getting ready to do it all over again tonight. <laughs> Not all over. We're going to dinner. Maybe like a light going out spot after. But more chill vibes. The girl's room is strong right now. Hey guys, it's a slick back kind of night. Literally me and Delaney both were like slick back. I love this dress. It's from Meshki. I always forget about Meshki and then I go online and they have the cutest pieces and it's pretty good quality too. There's like these flowers, it's a halter, long dress. We are going to dinner at Scarpetta, which is the restaurant, it's an Italian restaurant at Gurney's in Montauk. Trying to figure out, oh, come on, come here, come here. Look how darling she looks. Hi. I love it. Where is this from? It's from Maurizio. It's cute. Pretty recent, yeah. It's newest Thanks. season, Aritzia. I'm like really tall enough because I have heels on. I'll put heels on shortly and we'll be kind of trying to decide which earrings are neither. Um, I have my starfish Montauk earrings from my collection, which I'm kind of leaning towards. Or these. I think the starfish. I've decided. Here's the fits. This little pretty shell bag is from J. Crew. I'm gonna wear my same Dolce Vita heels that I wore to Common Ground last night, even though they're literally trashed. My little Montauk earrings. I like it, I like it a lot. Everyone looks so good. We're doing some pics down by the pool. Everyone's going. How cute they look. 
We're all trying to get our pictures before we leave. You guys look stunning. You look stunning. No, you look stunning. <laughs> I love the orange and brown. I've never done that and now I'm like obsessed. It's very Hermes, I feel like. We just got back and we discovered the hot tub in this house. Yeah, no, not the strobe lights. Hate, hate. But we're trying to get it hotter so that we can vibe out here. Good morning, everybody. Happy Sunday. We all woke up feeling so lovely and refreshed because we just had the long dinner. And then we went, we came back here and we got in the hot tub. It was so nice. We're gonna go get breakfast, I think at Amber Waves and drop Caitlin off at the train station because she goes to work. And then the rest of us are gonna go to the beach. Um, so I've got my little beach fit on. I'm wearing these pants from the Attico and the way they styled it on the website was with like a zebra bikini. So I'm going all zebra. Got my black Havianas. I went to bed with wet hair last night, so that's what we're working with. And then um, my kind of handsome hat, sunglasses are Amazon, Cherry is Landon and Kelly's. Um, but we're gonna have a lovely day. There she goes! Oh my god, guys, we just raced to the Keelan on that train. It's a beautiful Sunday. And Kelly just finally got to see. Oh, she's filming it. She did the magazine cover nice. for Brooks. Why is the ah! like, why is that? Just dropped the last pairs. group <laughs> at the train station. Pairs, no. Pairs. <laughs> yes, Kelly wants pears. Four or five ripe pears, she said. Um, and we're getting groceries to make dinner tonight. We're doing some grilling action. And then we're gonna go see a movie tonight. I feel so beach. I'm like still in my literally my ocean hair cover up situation but it's so beach my job is beach ryan's looking for honey for our salad dressing tonight you got the honey 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 it's cozy time girls room love island we cleaned and a candle is lit and it feels lovely shower changing to the park set We've got Love Island on, starting to prep for dinner. Kelly's making- Just domesticated, you know. You know, it's whatever, wipe her off. She's making a beautiful, oh, is this Kenzie's salad? Oh, she'll be so excited. I make it all the time. I don't think I've ever tagged her or told her, but I love it. Oh, she'll love that. Oh, she'll love that. We've got the salad going on here, and then I believe there's some boys out here grilling some turkey burgers and corn. Okay, the boys are, Cooking up some corn, zucchini, this is stunning. Cherries, of course, um, chauffeur, what's the word, chaperoning. And I'm so excited. I didn't realize, Kelly, you were like such a good salad maker. I hate making salads, like I prefer to buy them. Really? Yeah, I just feel like I never get it down, but this is a good, but that actually I recently discovered a salad I like, but this <laughs> will make. But anyways, here they come. Yum. Wow. Fam dinner is done and now we're all gonna go to the movies. There's this really cute like old-fashioned looking movie theater in East Hampton and I really want to see the new Twister movie um, and I was like Ryan do you want to go and then everyone's like wait I want to go. I was, Perfect. We're going to the movies so everyone's lo we're loading up the cars now. We're gonna head to the movie theater. I've got a little cozy set on. I feel like I got some sun today. This is my hair from the ocean, you guys. Like, I literally didn't wash it. The town has gotten way less busy. I love it. The Weekenders have left. You excited for the movie? I'm pumped. I can't There's wait. a Luke Combs song in it. That'll be fun. 
Okay. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Pick a candy, any candy. Wow, everyone's going for the dipped pretzels. Maybe like peanut and M's. I'm not really a candy person. I'm more of a popcorn girl. Guys. Spoiler, 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 spoiler. No, I'm saying that. All right. All I'll say is that we wanted to happen didn't happen. We're pissed. It was such a good movie until the very end. Nothing. Good morning. Look at that morning sun. We're gonna go get coffee. Okay, so we were gonna go to Round Swamp, but Round Swamp was closed. The two girls went sad. off to, yeah, we're really sad. I still haven't been this year, um, but they went to Pilates and we're gonna go to Cinderella and get some goodies for the house, just some fresh groceries, stuff like that, and then get them from Pilates, go home, and then I have a workout. Okay, we've been out and about already this morning. Okay, the girls did their Pilates class, but I wanted to go to coffee with them before and get a couple groceries, stuff like that. And now I'm headed to Bridgehampton to do a dance body workout class. I'm so excited. It's literally like, I think it's hip hop choreography. This class was called Hip Hop Hits. So I'm hopeful. I've just been craving dance. I thought maybe Kelly would want to go, um, but she had, already, she had already signed up for New York Pilates, so I'm gonna go see what this is all about. They, I obviously recently went to Dance Body Sculpt with Colby and Tribeca, but this one, this is closed. But this one is just like all dance cardio, which I could use. That'd be really fun. Oh, I gotta go. It's a 25 minute ride. Um, but I'm excited to have a little alone time and get some dancing in. Also wearing this super cute little lobster tank. I got a stain, so I wiped it off, but it's from a boat. So cute, let's go. Oh my goodness, you guys. <laughs> that was a class and a half. I knew I was warned that like, it's hard because if you don't know the choreo already, you have to kind of keep up. Uh, I guess they, ch I asked the instructor afterwards, she was so cool. Um, she said they changed the choreography quarterly, but like out in the Hamptons, they just keep it the same all summer. So the next time the dances will change will be in October. So I picked it up pretty fast, but like it was hard, <laughs> but it was so fun. Like I sweat so much. Um, everyone in there definitely, I was definitely the only one that was the first time there. She said like, it takes three to five classes to really get it down. And they also offer privates if you want to like learn the choreo. I don't think I need to do that. Like I was able to keep up for the most part, um, but it's hard, but it was so fun. She did like a lot of Drake music, which I obviously adored. Um, so now we're gonna head back and kind of get started with the day. It's already 11.30. I'm gonna take, I took one half of a ginger shot. I'm gonna take the second half now. Woo! That feels great. Vulnerable moment time. Something just happens when I talk to my mom and I cry, not in a bad way. Like she just gets so deep and uh, she's the best. As you guys know, I get like really anxious about like health things. I got like, I did a blood test and my one of my last couple vlogs because I haven't been to a doctor in forever honestly like I've been to the, I go to the gyno every year I went to a cardiologist a few years ago when I was having really bad anxiety and I thought it was like heart issues whatever um and but I just knew I needed to just go to a doctor so I decided to do well she's functional medicine and internal medicine like she's an internal medicine doctor who has a holistic approach which was perfect for me um so I got a blood test that just literally tests everything in my body which I wanted but I knew there was no way it was gonna all come back green perfect and there's just like something like I got all my lab results this morning and my dad's a physician so I like sent it to him and I just saw some things like when at least on this website like when certain things are out of whack it's like bright red like and it just like alarms me because I have health anxiety so I'm just like talking to my mom about it and you know she was affirming me that everything's okay and like these blood tests like that's what they're for and it's nothing like super alarming it's just like certain levels are off 
So like maybe I need to change things I'm eating or working out even more, just like being more active, like just like different things. I don't know. My doctor hasn't even called me about it. Like my my next appointment with her isn't for until September, but she said like she would call me if she felt something was urgent, which I'm like, if she calls me that something's urgent, I'm just gonna freak out. But at the same time, that means we're getting ahead of it. I'm 25 years old, I'm a healthy individual. And I'm so grateful that I was able to get these tests and to do them so that I can adjust and have a big glow up maybe. Um, I also have to get my hormones tested, not have to, but I wanted to get my hormones tested. And she basically shared with me, she was like, we can do that and I'd like to do that, but if you want to do that, you have to go off birth control for a couple months because it would be no good to test your hormones right now. So I just went off birth control, but the last day of my like placebo pack was like two days ago. So I'm like curious to see how I start feeling. I'm also scared I'm gonna start breaking out. I'm just like having all these thoughts. <laughs> Watch me be crying because I just went off birth control. I don't know. I feel like it takes a while to like get out of your system. I have no idea. But I just thought I'd share all this with you guys. I'll probably talk about it more on the podcast with Brooke, but um, there were certain levels that I was like concerned about. I don't know why, and they were fine. So like, it's good to know just for your knowledge and then to get ahead of things. Like it's just a reminder to you guys because I know a lot of you guys have expressed the same thing that you feel nervous about health related things and I totally get it. But at the end of the day, it's information for us to use to better ourselves. And that's what I'm telling myself. So I don't know why I'm sharing all this because I hate sharing this stuff at the same time because then people comment and like freak me out more. So please don't comment things to freak me out, please. Like I can't handle it. Um, if you want to comment supportive things, I will take it or just like little things to think about. But Ugh. so then my mom called and was like, I heard you were texting your dad about the tests. Like it's okay. And then I was like, ah. But anyways, uh, the class was great. As I said, I was doing good things for my body and it's Monday. I need to get to it. I have work to do, shower, Ryan and Graham. I was just pulling up and they were pulling out, going to the gym. Everyone's on a great little routine here, so but I need to like shower and do all those things. It's about three o'clock now. I just got a couple hours of work done and Jerry came out with me and Ryan's out here and we're having a little afternoon pool moment. I love this swimsuit, it's from Revolve. It's so cute. And I've just been prepping stuff as well because I'm filming AM Uncovered tomorrow in the Hamptons. One with, in the morning, we're filming Rebecca Minkoff, fashion designer. We're going to her house in the Hamptons and we're doing her AM Uncovered. I cannot wait to see her morning routine. And then we're gonna come back and we're gonna do my AM Uncovered in the Hamptons. So in my, like, in our Hamptons house, which would be so fun. Normally we always film these in the morning, but since I'm doing two in a day and I'm training or I'm getting paying for my, videographer to come out here for the day um we have to film mine in the afternoon so but normally they really are filmed in the morning um but i'm excited <laughs> he's fighting with me because he has the most perfect outfit on and then puts on this no <laughs> he goes how will people know we went to georgia um no that shirt is so nice on you we are having a date night tonight Monday. we should do a pookie tiktok um, look, oh my god, I need to ask Maggie to take a picture of us. Like, we're so cute. <laughs> um, I'm wearing this stud dress tonight with a little stud bag. And we're going to dinner in Sag Harbor tonight. I love Sag Harbor. We're going to try and get there in time for, um, <laughs> for sunset and, like, watch it. And we're going to dinner at this place called Lulu Kitchen. I am so excited. Are you excited? Yeah, I'm pumped. Yay. Here is a full body of the dress. I have everything linked on my LTK. I'm wearing these shell earrings from Electric Picks. And we just did a video where Ryan does the voiceover of my Get Ready With Me. So go to my TikTok to watch that. It's so funny. down Main Street in Sag Harbor. Ryan's never been, but this area reminds me of Nantucket hardcore. We're going to Lulu Kitchen. A little Mediterranean moment. Just got to the restaurant, such a vibe. They put little matchboxes at your table, which I so appreciate. It looks so pretty. A little night out. Woo! Yum. <laughs> 